Oh my god. You and your fucking multitude of voices and characters. What's a character? No, it's a character. <laughs> it was, uh, oh, you know what? Last night, uh, I was thinking of um, one of your characters because uh, we were Why? watching, we were watching, um, <laughs> now, now don't, I don't even know how we get into these little Sesame Street. No, it oh. wasn't Sesame Street. I was fascinated with uh, uh, corporate um, videos, like like uh, like training videos, training videos, self help, motivational huh? videos, motivational videos that like a new real manager ones. would watch. Yes, yeah. about leadership and synergy and stuff because they're so embarrassing. They're they're horribly done. All they do is state the obvious, right, and uh, try to make it seem like they're they're in the know. And this guy's name was Greg Schinkel. <laughs> and all I could think is that is a Jimmy's character's name. It was like, it, it was this guy's, his name was Gr Greg Schinkel. And all I'm thinking is Jim going, that's Greg Schinkel. Why would I say that? It's my no, name. Oh, no. Now his name's. <laughs> What's your name? Now but, something in your throat, guy's voice. Uh, the guy is. That is I'm Greg Schinkel. Greg Schinkel. <laughs> Craig Schinkel? Yeah, Craig Schinkel. Greg Schinkel. <laughs> Craig Schinkel. Oh, no, it's spelled S-C-H-I-N-K-L-E. Oh. No, I'm Craig Schinkel. I, I hate how Craig Schinkel's voice <laughs> drops out just at the end of his name. What? You can't hear that L properly. Okay. Craig Schinkel. <laughs> oh, there it is. Expert. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Why this are you watching guy, this? I don't know. It, it's it's just one of those YouTube things you end up going to. Do you have no idea how you got there? Um, Sounds like my name. Yeah, we got it. <laughs> yeah, I was I was out to dinner with uh, Ileana, and we were talking about um, these corporate videos and uh -huh. how bad they are, and how ridiculous, and and team leadership, and and the words they just throw around. That mean nothing. Buzzwords. Buzzwords. Yeah. That the the board in the in the in the um in the conference room that that has like leadership and uh, stuff written on company it. company values. It, yes, yes, yes. Um, this guy has a shitload of videos. If you if you just go to it, go to his um, his, click on his the name of that thing. Yeah, and and go to videos. Is he good? Up, yeah, there. He's so bad. <laughs> and now scroll down to like him talking about oh, just pick anything, really. All right. Pick one and listen to the nonsense. What about that one with the hard hat? Leadership challenges faced by supervisors. Oh, these are little skits that they, I like this, they put the idea on. of a skit. Put on a skit. That first uh, one. A Greg Schinkel original. Yeah. yeah. Let's see okay. what he's talking about here. Leadership challenges. Um, faced by... Hey, man, how's it going? Oh, this is what happens when... Good. Guys get in the car. Your leader is day. also a friend. Yeah, that's right. How was your weekend? Oh, it was great. You're the boss. Did you see the uh, Giants on TV last night? Yeah. yeah. Oh, the no, Giants on TV. Well, Could you play, I would like to say, <laughs> how come he's not saying we're on our way to work? Score, Why are you driving three miles an hour? <laughs> <laughs> They're in a car. Yes. Driving at a fucking... It's the worst <laughs> pace I've ever seen. <laughs> Very slow. I think the cameraman was walking backwards in front of the car. Hey, man. Man, did you this. watch the Giants on TV this weekend? I certainly did. Slow down. You're hitting four. <laughs> <laughs> did you enjoy the, the National Football League? Yes. No. Yes. Did you enjoy? Yeah. <laughs> I love Greg Schinkel probably wrote this. He thinks he's, he's oh, quite yeah, a... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm Craig Schinkel. I know oh, what your name Craig is. Craig Schinkel. You're not Greg Schinkel. Okay. How's it going? Oh, good. Oh. Good for another hard day. Yeah, hard right. day. They're How's from the Ontario. Oh, it was great. There's, did you see the uh, Giants on TV last night? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Slow. That was an awesome game. I had it playing while I was uh, doing paperwork. Definitely a good score. They're talking each other. They're friends. Definitely a Man, good score. 14. Yeah, what good score. What, is what are they talking about? Yeah, I. Well, well, hold on. <laughs> what paperwork were you doing, cunt face? <laughs> 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 Who does paperwork on a Sunday night? <laughs> 
<laughs> well, he's working very diligently. But you could tell these guys are friends. No, you can't. No? They look like two strangers <laughs> that have been thrusted into a car, and they're having different conversations. <laughs> like, they look like they're in different dimensions, just missing each other. Yeah, yeah. I've never said to someone that was a really good score. A really yeah. good score. Unless they, they fucked a hot chick. <laughs> yeah. I've said or you that. just robbed a bank and got away with it. <laughs> yeah, or he pulled some coke out of his pocket. <laughs> and the car really is just in neutral on an ever so slight hill. Oh, just yeah. Rolling I barely rolling. Slowly. I wouldn't even say that to a guy who did music for a movie. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Well, I was uh, doing paperwork. Definitely a good score, though. I couldn't believe it. Oh, 17, man. 14. What that a pass. Did you see that pass? Well, it was, pass. it was like out of the air. He just Holy pulled it down. Smokes. Like there was nothing. And it went right in. <laughs> I can't believe like it. Like it went right in. <laughs> yeah, we went worked right, right next to an back. underpass. <laughs> <laughs> no kidding. All right, man. I'll see you back here. At All right. Four. Hey, right see at the you back door. here at you four. Right here. Like always. Awesome. Ready to go to work. But the problem wait, is, wait. the one guy's the supervisor, the other guy's just a subordinate. Why did he say, like, oh, why would he ask him, are you yeah. going to pick me up right here? That's where he always... <laughs> He's very you nervous. you be here, you promise! Look what, he, now they're in the break room. He's the boss, though. Right. He doesn't look like the boss. Well, Brandon. he is. Good sound editing. Yeah, what's up, man? What's up with this? I, I, I just got a complaint that for the third time this week, you were late for lunch. Carl had to cover your shift. Uh-oh. Oh, come on, John. You, you know, man, people are late all the time. I always cover for people. It's not a big deal. It is a big deal. Look, I'm responsible for everybody, not just Come you. on, Dennis. And when stuff like this happens, people look at me and wonder what's going to happen. Okay. If Hold on. Can you rewind? Because I, I wanted to make sure that I could hear happens twice very quickly. <laughs> Sometimes you want to hear the word happen right after happens. <laughs> it's a sign of excellent writing. It's, to, it's very ready to squeeze in two happens. Did you curse or threaten this man with violence in any way? Yeah. <laughs> Come on, Dennis. I cover Carl's shift. You're fired. This week you were late for lunch. Carl had to cover your shift. Oh, come on, John. You, you know, man, people are late John, all the you time. Read? I always cover for people. It's not a big deal. It is a big deal. Look, I'm responsible for everybody, not just you. And when stuff like this happens, people look at me and wonder what's going to happen. Happen, happen. <laughs> when this stuff happens, it's going to happen yeah. on the happen. What was this, happenstance? <laughs> 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 that's just so uh, awful. Oh, that's horrible. That's terrible writing. <laughs> <laughs> this writing is the worst. When this stuff happens, people look at me like, what's going to happen? What's going to happen? <laughs> oh, for people, it's not a big deal. It is a big deal. Look, I'm responsible for everybody, not just you. And when stuff like this happens, people look at me and wonder what's going to happen. <laughs> okay, if that's what the management wants, uh -oh. then I guess I'll be on time from now on. No excuses. Okay, all right, that's fine. You know what? Let's just leave it there. I'm not going to write you up or anything. Oh. But just make sure you follow the rules like everybody else in this plant. All right, fine. Got it, we done. Good. Yeah. Oh, shit. He's oh, look, he it. slams his fucking mask down. He's mad. Yeah, but you lose the attitude, kid. Look, he's still pissed. He's fuming. <laughs> he severs his fingers in this machine. Now it's four o'clock. Look a, at this. And he has a gun. <laughs> <laughs> now the boss shuts the lights out. He's he's going to the door where he's supposed to meet his buddy. Who he Is just... that his thermos? Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's great. He's been sitting on it all day. <laughs> <He's>... <laughs> now his buddy. Hey, buddy. He waited there for He waited for him to come out before he screams away. Oh, the guy just drove away. He ditches him at the door. The hey, boss. buddy. That's fuck awesome. You. You're late. I bet the guy was a minute late. That's yeah. what I was going to say. You are a minute late. <laughs> fuck you. He's like, you yell at me? The, I ain't driving you home. The sound editing was good. The, oh, yeah. the, the sound editing and the fact that he's parked on an oil spill. <laughs> yeah. And he's just driving into obviously no neighborhood. I love that he fucking just hit the gas and the go fuck yourself boss man the boss had no idea that the car could go that fast because yeah. you've never seen it go four <laughs> oh, miles an hour yeah <laughs> how can we not like this when we're running late for work in the morning yeah did you see that score that pass yeah ah, it went right in what, what a good what score went in. <laughs> what a good score thing just a nice did. round number well, of course after he peels out he just starts driving four miles an hour and the boss catches up to him walking exactly just passes yeah. him caves his head in with his ther that's a that thermos is full of cum by the way <laughs> All the workers have to jerk it off into it before they leave, and the boss drinks it on the way home. <laughs> I hate this company. Oh, it's terrible. What do they make? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Car parts.
I that think. I don't know. I'll bet you. I'll bet you that they make some weird product, uh, like fucking like asshole skin lining for people who've had surgery. Oh yeah. Oh, uh, uh, earn respect by being respectful. Ooh. I think is the one with the hole at the Craig Shink. Dude, I, I have to know how this ends. <laughs> yeah, this yeah. movie is great. Well, <laughs> the peel you know, the best. We've only got two minutes left. That guy, oh, okay. that, he's, he's got to walk home. <clears throat> he's yeah. He's fucked now. Yeah, some yeah. boss. I think Greg Shinkle comes on and explains what oh, happened Craig there Schinkel. and okay. and how to prevent things like that from happening. Understood. Ready? <laughs> uh huh. What's up, no friends? Hey, buddy. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. There's no company fucking front? No. Yeah, so one of the biggest things that we have as huh? lead hands and working leaders is the situation where we may have been friends with, or at least co-workers, whether we're good buddies or not, right. with the people that we're yeah. expected to lead. And the reality is day in and day out, we're going to have to work with these folks. And so sometimes that ends up being a reason why we don't tell somebody something, because uh -huh. we're afraid that we're going to have to live with the repercussions of we their should, response you know to what? us. You guys should listen to this. That especially yeah. is where uh, someone is promoted into the mm. working lead or lead hand oh. position uh, Travis. over some other people that well, are in the organization. Some that's people that might have worked there even longer. They might have felt like they e should have gotten the job e that you're now wow. in as a working lead. Right. Uh -huh. And so instead of accepting that, what they do is they make fun of it. They ah, they say Dr. that you're lucky that you got the job or that <laughs> yeah. you barely deserve getting the job or that I they say that all really the time. Yeah. Absolutely. And they really kind of get in your or face. Or like Travis that. does a bad Again, job. Right. That right. Yes. What it is, right. Which is he defense. That's why Eric defended me on Facebook. Yes. 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 Uh, them accepting yeah. the fact that maybe they didn't possess all of the skill sets, personality the skill skills, set. communication e skills and things it was that all those things probably for that position. And instead of wanting to say that, hey, maybe you had those skill sets and they didn't, what they'd rather do is just kind of attack Attack you and pick on you. <laughs> and, and unfortunately, if you get sucked into trying to defend the decision, uh -huh. you only keep the argument going. Right. So, what do you have to do? Uh, you kind of have to suck it up and live with suck it for a, a while. Cock. And that's where the good leadership skills this come in. This is the worst because advice I've ever heard. Time, it's you're not such a bad person. This you didn't let advice. the power go to your head. No. You're still participative and helpful. You have to sit and, there and let somebody and drive off without person. you. Yeah. Then we get into this issue of discipline. And sometimes mm. your co workers Kinky. could screw up something <laughs> to see whether you're going to get sucked in to chasing them around. Can you Again, pause, if they please? Have a oh I just want to look at the fucking fat backs on these people. <laughs> look at this. He's, not, he's he just pan back to realize yes. he's, like in a, he's like in a conference room with a chart on a on a, a board up, and he's talking to. I guess there's like ten or twelve people in there, and they're the fat back blonde on the right is <laughs> is enragingly fat. It looks, looks like, like Warren Haynes. This is the audience that fucking like um was from the office. When uh, uh, Gervais, yeah, when yeah. Gervais did his <laughs> motivational <laughs> speech, yeah. Uh, yeah, you're looking at me. You've achieved your dreams. Your dreams. Get out. Get out. Get out. Was that uncomfortable? Oh, fantastically uncomfortable. You're not gonna make it. Yeah. 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 And then the maid <laughs> she comes in. <laughs> no, 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 not now. <laughs> Are you finished? No. No. <laughs> Gets all mad. She ruined his whole get out. His big moment. Get out. <laughs> if you don't want to be here, you're not going to make it. Yeah. <laughs> Chasing the next. Yankee dollar. We'll watch that next. Oh, I love that <laughs> one. It's so awful. Um, yeah, well, uh, yeah, he, he just goes on and on about... about um, He's basically just telling that doing. guy, walk home. Yeah. Walk home. Don't be friends with the motherfucker. Yeah. That's it. You're a disciplinarian. That was well acted, though, those guys. Oh, wasn't that? John. Hey. Uh, see it four, as usual, right here. So you can peel out and throw fucking gravel into my face. You drive, John? <laughs> <laughs> you drink cum, John? <laughs> <laughs> oh, boss. Oh, this is exactly, you know, the, the, he, he hit it right feel, on the head. I try and laugh several times a day, just oh. because it makes you feel laugh. good. So let's Well, let's this is not the out. beginning of it. No. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> it's the no. clip that the BBC put up. <laughs> just, just... That's it. <laughs> Come on, trust me, you'll feel. <laughs> but he doesn't do the simply the best. Is he? This four minute long. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I... <laughs> David Brent is one of the greatest characters <laughs> ever. He's, he's, yeah, he's on tour now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What's he gonna do? Uh, music, right? Yeah, I'm dying. I'll Play be some of the the songs. Rest. He should. <laughs> oh. 
his his uh, assistant there for the Dawn. day. Dawn is lying. disgusted. My life had turned out exactly as I'd expected. <laughs> <laughs> my old school just recently had a school oh, we can't reunion. Just sit and watch the yeah, I know. Um, which I um was I'd there another to, but was there another shinkle video you wanted to show? There was one with a fat uh, woman um, and a ratchet wrench. Uh, oh yeah, a ratchet wrench. <laughs> oh, Imagine no. if Jack oh, Nicholson. No. <laughs> hey, hey, nurse oh, wrench. Oh, what are you doing there, acting all screwy? Oh, no. <laughs> One flew over the toolbox. Uh, I think, is that it? Let's see. Uh, that one says, um, 30, no, no, keep going a little more. So what about the piggy? Yeah, the, uh, the pig is how you draw a pig. I know it's, we, the jokes would write themselves as they say. Keep going until you see like another skit. I see a lot oh, of Oh, there skits. it is. On the, on the left, <coughs> all the way to the left with her. There it is. Right. Now this is earn respect by being respectful. And it, it looked like the actors did such a good job last time that they used the same actors? Same act. Well, well no, they got a, a, a fat whole woman in this. This could be part of Jocktober because she is literally a hole in this fucking uh, skit. Terrible. <laughs> Respect this, works both ways. If we recognize that as a leader, uh, we want to give people, we want to thank them for their contributions. We, when we ask them to do things, not we'd like to be polite about it and respectful be to them. Yeah. And he thinks he's generally speaking, making highlight leaders. the positives of what they're doing. Oh. So just practicing Accentuate some of those the things. positives. And you, huh. what you'll find is that there's slight nuances in leadership that we're going to go and into some old that answers. make a big difference between <laughs> whether the hilarious. employees respect you as a leader and want to work with you, oh. or whether they would rather not work with you, and oh, so they're Tendencies to Iraq. avoid doing what you ask them to do. Oh, and a lot of that has oh, to do with your attitude Sale. and approach yep. that you take with them. Okay, here it is. Oh, here's the sketch. George. Look at this pig. Fat lady. What's up? Broken. It's oh, my third good. one this year. Is she you sure it's broken? <laughs> She's it's broken. How'd you do that? She has a broken oh, ratchet. Hold on. Let's put the, fix it. They're both in the fucking, this little work area, and they're both wearing these fucking yellow hard hats. Yellow hard hats. And like worker blue, like, like. Blue old. smock type uh, fucking things. Yeah. And she's got this ratchet yeah. wrench, and apparently it's broken, and she'd previously broken some before. So yeah. she's a little nervous about going yeah. to the boss. She's fat. She probably eats them. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Oh, no. Yeah, so she has to. Uh oh. Really well acted. Oh no, what happened? Come on, Travis, stop butchering uh, you, this. You pulled a Sam on that. Exactly. You went. Uh, Sam always rewinds to the beginning. Yeah, okay, I love that. Go. Oh no. What's up? Who goes, Why would she do that? It's it's trying to, trying to molest sure them? It's, <laughs> it's broken. It's How'd you do that? Oh my god, I know. If I knew I could fix it. Listen, you know what? You should really go tell John about this because, I mean, he'll want to know. He's got to order John. that, right? I can't do that. The last time we did this, the last boss, he yelled at me for like an hour. Could you pause this? Well, Why would she say the last boss instead of just saying the guy's name? They worked together. The last <laughs> boss. The last man in charge and I was a subordinate. How many are they going through? Exactly. The last boss. What are they, a fucking Al-Qaeda cell? <laughs> <laughs> you know, when Al Zarqawi, you know what he would do when I would break the wrench? <laughs> I'm sure if it was some fucking hot girl. There'd be no problem with her going in. Oh, I broke the wrench. Oh, it's okay, sweetie. Exactly. This fucking heifer. The fact that it's a fucking fat, shapeless pig. Ugh. She sh she shaped like a zucchini. <laughs> or, you know, she shaped like a fucking yam. <laughs> a fucking fat yam with a perm. <laughs> <laughs> it's John before. I mean, he's not he's not like that at all. He, he'll understand. But what if he doesn't? I can't afford to lose my job right now. Over a broken we wrench? It. We'll never find out. Okay, well, uh, pause. If we fix it, though. How do you fix a breaks? wrench? Yeah, what is she going to do? <laughs> Shove it up that magical pussy of hers. <laughs> Give it a few <laughs> jig jiggles. And how fucking on top of things is the boss that he's going to notice that a wrench in a giant shop is broken? Yes! <laughs> they should have had to, like, bust a big fucking machine or something. He didn't fire me for leaving him standing there. He's not going to fire you over a wrench. <laughs> this is hideous. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, and when somebody else is using it, they get hurt. Could you live with yourself? Like, really? Oh. I could pay for it. Do you think the company would take it out on my pay? No, listen, how about I go over there with you? 
Okay, and I'll make sure you know that you're you're there. I'll, I'll pump you up, and I'm sure pump you up. he's not I'll gonna have up. any problem. Come on, he's not gonna have any problem with it. He's at pushing all. this fat pig across the Disgusting. He's gonna get a hand truck. And when he sh that was actually kind of funny. <laughs> shoved her. He shoves her to the door, and big fat soul rolls forward. <laughs> oh. oh, she's nervous. She's her. banging on the boss's door. Yeah, this obvious. This obvious. This yes. is a classroom that he's sitting in. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Come in. What was that? <laughs> Dramatic pause. Hey, Melissa, what's up? Uh -oh. um, uh, Hold on, pause. He's <laughs> sitting in front of a fucking 1988 computer monitor, which is off. <laughs> <laughs> he has no paperwork in front of him, and he's just no. looking at two pictures of his family. <laughs> two pictures of his family. And one's in black and white. It looks like fucking my three sons. <laughs> this is the worst <laughs> set. <laughs> he's like in a science classroom. <laughs> All right. I have to tell you. Go um, ahead. It wasn't my fault. What did you do? What's not your fault? It was I drowned my children. Yeah. <laughs> I was washing them and they, that's, they stopped breathing, so I backed my van into the lake. <laughs> <laughs> and I blamed a Negro. <laughs> All right. No problem. All right. As long as you didn't break the wrench, get back to work. <laughs> accident. I don't know how it happened. She it shit herself. <laughs> what just happened? What happened? Well, I was sneezing and I had a miscarriage and John <laughs> slipped in it and broke the wrench. <laughs> <laughs> Technically, it's my fault. <laughs> <laughs> <It's sweet>. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> uh, hey, let's see how, the, how John reacts to this uh, horrible story. What happened? <laughs> what happened? I broke my ratchet the third time this year. This year? Jesus, Jesus Christ. Christ. It's January 2nd. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you... Use Get fucked, you fat uh, cunt. <laughs> my ratchet for now. Oh. Ooh. It's a good and he's loading a yeah. gun. <laughs> oh, thank you, thank you. Oh, happy uh -oh. pig. Yes. Oh. oh, and the guy is standing with <laughs> the, no, guy, to... the guy is her friend's waiting outside the office. Yeah. And he's got his arms folded and he's leaning against a ladder. Yeah, like yeah. A sexy pose. All cool. <laughs> yeah. Waiting to see how this turned out. Yeah, waiting to see what fucking happens you know, with Wilbur the pig. <laughs> <laughs> All right, she comes out. The boss is ratchet. So, how'd it go? I had him eaten out of the palm of my hand. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> you, you wouldn't let anyone eat anything that was in the palm of my hand. What was in there? Nothing but skin because all the food uh, went into my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> I, had him, I had him licking the crumbs out of the palm of my hand. It was his own cum. <laughs> she was the boss is a cum eater. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's what she did. Uh, uh, cum in one hand, <laughs> shit in the other. She's giving him a little bodily fluid buffet. <laughs> oh, that was so great. Uh, the boss just had a ratchet on top of the file cabinet. How convenient. Uh, he demonstrates course. it. My ratchet. The third time this year I broke one. <laughs> Why would you announce that? Exactly. Why not just say I had a ratchet broke? Someone broke yeah. it. Yeah. Use it to loosen the lugs on that scumbag I used to drive in with <laughs> his fucking tires who kills himself on the way home. <laughs> I hate these relationships these people have at this oh, job. It's terrible. What a terrible company. It's just terrible. You want to watch another one? There's, um, I desperately want another one. Yeah, it's better than uh, the wire. I don't even <laughs> the wire. <laughs> yeah, these are uh, Greg uh, Greg Schinkel's I'm Craig shit. Um, corporate motivational uh, videos. I don't know how uh, we ended up here last night to, watching one. these. What is that this one? Is, uh, different approaches to dealing with a problem employee. Oh, he's a problem employee. Well, we so. got a few of those around here. Maybe we can learn from that. Let's give it a give it a watch. You know, John. Overall, things are working very well. <laughs> oh my God! There's a new character. Oh my God! Ah, ah, this is the big boss now. Uh, yeah, it's the, it's the father-in-law from Fargo. <laughs> <laughs> We're not a bank, Jerry. He's got a gruff voice, and they're they're in the classroom slash office, and he's lecturing him. Uh, I guess. Why don't you go see old Bill Deal? 
Uh, yeah, he's now talking. He's definitely upper management, this yeah. guy. Yeah. He's now talking with the head guy from the shop, yeah. the guy that has just had a ratchet laying around, and yeah. uh, giving him the what have you. You know, John, overall, things are working very well. Now, that, that new widget we have, it's uh, selling like hotcakes. The, widget. <laughs> <laughs> the new widget. We're we... selling the widget like hotcakes. Like hotcakes. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking asshole. <laughs> Oh, yeah, God. new widget we have is selling like hotcakes. Yeah, selling like hotcakes. Well, I always wondered, why don't we just sell hotcakes? Yeah, <laughs> that new thing we're selling, the Jew Finder. I can't believe how many people are buying it. It finds a Jew in the middle of a crowd. Shames them. <laughs> you know, that new widget we have is uh, selling like hotcakes. Trucks in with widgets, trucks out with widgets, 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 in and out, in and out of widgets. You're doing very Oof. well for us. And all those things I did when I was lead hand are finally starting to pay off for this company. The only thing that I regret that I, I is hiring those regret. goddamn blacks. <laughs> <laughs> I've been having wrenches turn up broken, and I know it's the blacks. <laughs> Certainly isn't that chubby, cute gal out there. <laughs> <laughs> Did you knock off a piece of her yet? I was fucking her in the toilet the other day. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you know, she likes putting my cum in her hand and feeding it to me. Absolutely. <laughs> While the other guy stands there sexually against the ladder watching the whole thing. <laughs> the only thing that I regret that I, uh, you know, I was unable to get rid of that slacker Watson. Watson? You know, he was useless. I tried everything. I'd give him a simple job. He couldn't even do that. Oh, we rock. I had no confidence. <laughs> I tried yelling at him, screamed at him, yeah. pushed him. Gave out his phone number. He's <laughs> walking this guy all over. Oh, he's, and then he just hands up a broom and a pail, you useless fuck. What did you end up doing with Actually, sir, I took a, a, a bit of a different approach. And it, when I watched him on the floor, it looked like he was kind of bored. And every time he, he made trouble, uh, he did it for attention. So what I did is I, I, I got him to try out a bunch of different jobs, all right. and I took Hold some on, extra call. time and mentored him. But <laughs> after all that, it just seemed like he wasn't cut out for work on a factory floor. Just as I suspected. Mm. Terrible employee. Yeah. I told the That's company. That's right. So I, I said, cut his yeah, brake lines, and he was killed on the way home. <laughs> he wasn't listening. He wasn't listening. So uh, how did you finally get He's reading his stuff? lines from the fucking uh, desk. Tell you the truth, he's our newest engineer. What? He designed that widget that's selling so well. What? Uh, Whoa. He's got a he job. made and the Jew Finder? <laughs> so everything's going great. Loves his job. Everyone on the floor loves you him. You fucking and promoted really well. Charlie M? <laughs> oh, well, I guess every employee has some kind of skill. Some kind yeah. of yeah. kind of and right now I'm promoting unconstitutional. <laughs> I'm touring all over with it. <laughs>